Well, this video is sort of much ado about nothing. On this little carport we put up here, and then uh, you saw the anchors I put in. Anyway, I got, a, I think it's about four tons of chat. And uh, I had the, the friend of mine hold it with his dump trailer. He put it there on the far end, way out there. And I used my little bulldozer. And I'll tell you what, that little thing is the best. Of, that's the handiest thing. I got to put a new, different seat on it now. It's all broke off, but that's the handiest gizmo I've had in a long time. Of course, here on my porch, I've got all this junk around here, and I've got to get rid of this monstrosity that come off of old, old Smokey. I got him out of here, and uh, it's ready to be picked up. And, of course, we got this one. The guy told me if he had to spend more than $50, just tell me to keep it for parts or something, so. Well, I see it's going to be that much. The starter was all locked up, and the battery's bad, and I had to clean the carburetor, so it's going to be at least 50 or more, probably more than that time I get through figuring out what everything else is wrong. Okay, then we'll go down around here back and see what else we got here. I still haven't uh, gotten around to that old Cub Cadet. I want to take the... Well, I sold the deck off of it, so I got my money back out of the whole tractor now. Got a load of junk here. I got to haul down here and put it off. I can put that big motor on it on the porch in this trailer or sometime or other get it down here and of course there's the old golf cart which I could not get along without that that's like my outdoor wheelchair I'll tell you like my knees and everything are and there's old Smokey in good good repair now finally he's all ready to go and don't smoke at plenty of power and I think the guy's gonna be pleased with it and then we'll see down here around the garden area where we got a few things planted out here just some uh, yeah, some tomatoes, and, uh, and well, we got a heck of a stand of strawberries this year. I, I had to get involved in picking them. If I knew some kid I could rely on, I'd pay him to pick them berries. That's a job. We got bad knees anyhow. But anyway, then we got a few cabbages. I think they should have been planted a little deeper, but the wife didn't do it, so I, sh I didn't plant them. She did. And we got some uh, tomatoes going on out there. We got little, little ones about the size of your thumb on some of them, and then... Of course, way down there, you got the potatoes that uh, look like they're doing pretty good. I need to put some more straw, and I got some straw there, and it's about to deteriorate sitting out like that. But anyway, that's the way that works. And we'll go down here and take a look at these chickens right quick. The wife's got some lime in these buckets here. She wants to put on the thing, but I loaned the spreader out to the neighbor, and they haven't brought it back yet. Anyway, there's a bunch of garlic. I don't eat garlic much, but it's going to be pretty good when it gets done there. It's going to soon be ready, I think. It's starting to turn kind of brown. And, of course, I've got the chickens over here. These are, uh, I've got to get them some water here shortly because they don't have much water in there. These are the laying hens here. And uh, the ones on that other side are younger. Then, uh, let me get over here on the floor we can see better. <laughs> I know this is bouncy. I might cut that part out. Now what you got here is all these are the same age. Them big ones are them uh, Cornish Cross. They're about ready to butcher right now. They're the same age as these others. But, uh, but anyway, I, I, I don't really have the heart to kill anything, so that's the way that goes. Well anyway, this is kind of a gist of the thing. I got my old project over here. It's still sitting like it was. No better, no worse. I ain't got time to do nothing anymore, hardly seem like. And, well, anyway, that's kind of a kind of what's going on around here. And the wind's kind of blowing out here now, so it might be messy. All right, and of course we got the grapes and everything over there. You can't, probably can't see them very good, but they're coming along. All right, well that's a that's enough for this. Thanks for watching, subscribing, and rating, and commenting, and all that. So we'll talk to you later.